welcome to another series of our video what is history so in this video we will be talking about history so let's talk about history now history history is the study of the past present and future uh, when we are growing, uh, when we are in the low, lower grades, we are taught uh, 2 minus 5 because eh, it can't. But when we started growing, when we went into higher grades, where I said 2 minus uh, uh, 5, negative 3. We now got to understand. Same like history. History, when we were learning, when we were in lower grades and in, uh, in grades, we are taught eh? history is the study of the past. But uh, as we went in further, we were taught history is the study of the past, present, and future. We study the past uh, because the, 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 the past is the history, the present is history tomorrow, the, and the future will be history. Again, we study history for us to know why we are where we are and to know, uh, and also to be able to see the mistakes that we have made in the past so that we may collect them and uh, do things better. That is why we study history. Now, history is a study of the past, present, and future. Uh, now, we look at the African history. African history, number one, has been hidden. All the truth about African history has been hidden. So, uh, as a result, we have lost our heritage. Africa is uh, was the the first developed uh, continent in this world, and the people of Africa were the most intelligent uh, people. And uh, when we look at the history, uh, like. Uh, uh, there are a lot of well, debates that are coming up and also the discoveries. The discoveries like uh, we look at Egypt, the pharaohs were, were Africans, were blacks, not uh, white Africans. We look at uh, the Jews, the Jews were also, they are, it is believed that the Jews were also black. And uh, we, we have got... Uh, also, all the discoveries and all those things uh, that are good, they, are, they came from Africa. Now, all that history has been buried and we have been given the Western history, whereby uh, David Livingston discovered Victoria Force. Who told you that David Livingston is the one who discovered the Victoria Force? The, David Livingston just came when we have already discovered, we have called it Mosotonia. So there are, there are those uh, history whereby where there is a white person that is now, that is the thing that makes history. So our history, our true history has been hidden. And when we talk about the, our historical heroes, you find that since they, they, they were in a contrast, in, in a contrast with uh, uh, the whites, then they will be uh, Polish to be very evil. I'll give you an example like Shaka. Shaka has been uh, has been politicized by the Western history. Uh, his, uh, that he, Shaka was a very bad person and what, and they have painted a very negative uh, history. But when you go to the traditional history, Shaka is not uh, was not as he has been painted uh, now because they wanted to take over. Uh, the African countries and because him he couldn't allow them so they had to make him to be bad so such are the histories that uh, that that we, we we have and also we'll find that uh, they had to come and uh, destroy told us whatever that we were doing as Africans is demonic and we believed them and they brought us eh, the Christianity, which was not even biblical. As I said, said uh, in theology, most of the practices that, uh, that are practiced in the church, they are not even biblical. For example, the preaching of the, of, of the word. In Africa, we don't preach. Uh, in Africa, it's a, it's a, it's a continent where uh, we, are, uh, we are united. We live as families, like the Jews. 
And the Bible says, you and your household shall be saved. You and your household. There is nothing like, believe alone. Come to Jesus Christ. Forget about your mother. Forget about your father. It's you alone that is that is wasted. So, uh, because then they are selfish and each one looks at himself. Now, uh, that is the kind of heritage history that we, 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 we have. So, now... Also, we went through slavery, from slavery, colon, colonialism, from colonialism, apartheid, apartheid, and we went, we, we, we came on to uh, neo colonialism, uh, which is uh, economical colonialism, and what? So we have suffered in history, and that has deterred the African confidence in ourselves. So until we rewrite the history, then Africa is not going to uh, be proud, and it's not going to be what it is. Then we look at education. There is what is called African Education Act, whereby the, the education was formulated to be a slavery kind of education. Even when you look at the entrepreneurship uh, curriculums that we have in Africa, they will tell you that see, uh, entrepreneurship, it is when you are making, a, if you are a carpenter and you are making some stores, then you are an entrepreneur. But that is not how it is. We have to be in leadership. We have to be leaders. So as we have been taught as African, working hard, it is using the physical work. You should, uh, you should be very strong. And what? So we have been uh, programmed like that. Because like uh, I was presenting the lecture like uh, this one. Then someone called and said, what are you doing? He said, I'm sleeping. He said, ah, you should be, that is laziness. That is laziness because I am, uh, I am in the bedroom and I'm, uh, I'm presenting the lecture. And one thinks uh, I'm lazy because uh, they cannot see me working hard. So that is a kind of uh, the mentality that we have been given as Africans. So our history has much to be desired. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel.